Hi everyone. Today I am making a collage that is a hamburger and fries. It was really fun to make and I did not use any scissors. So stick with me and I will show you the steps that I use to make this collage. So for this project I've got a variety of magazines that I'm going to use and to make things easier for myself I've gone ahead and torn out some of the pages from those magazines um, just to kind of help me dial in the colors that I'll be using for this burger and I'm going to start with the bun so I found a sheet that has mostly brown on it I'm going to tear out two pieces that I will use for the top and the bottom of my bun. And this project requires no scissors. You just use your fingers to tear out the pieces of paper. So it's great for fine motor control and for engaging some of the hand strength that's needed to tear the paper. So now that I've got the top and the bottom of my bun torn out, I'm just going to start choosing the toppings for my hamburger. I've got a little bit of green here that I'll use as a lettuce and some red, maybe that can be my tomato and a dark brown that can be my hamburger patty. Go ahead and layer this up however suits your fancy. Um, while you're doing this you can have a great conversation about the things that your loved one might like to have on their burger and what color those items might be. If you want some red onions on there go ahead and find some nice purples to put in your burger. Um, some people like to have a fried egg, you know, um, so find something that might look like a fried egg. Go ahead and have fun with it. It can be any kind of burger. You can have any imaginative topping on there that you would like. So now that I've got my burger kind of assembled and I see how I want it to be laid out, I'm just going to glue that on using a glue stick onto a colored background. I've chosen red, but of course you can choose whatever color you like. And then I'm going to start working on the fries. So to make the fries, I just chose like a glass or a tumbler and then lots of bits of yellow paper and layered them in to make a very delicious looking container of fries. And once assembled, just glued that on next to my hamburger and there you have it. My very tasty looking collage art of a hamburger and fries. I hope you're feeling inspired to make your very own hamburger and fries collage, or maybe there's another dish that you want to try making. You really are your own chef. So until next time, take care. Bye-bye.